Hello, guys and girls of the Century League. This is week seven highlights. Um, I'm really tired. Someone's going to have to do previews by Sunday kickoff. Previews by Sunday kickoff. Somebody's got to do it. You guys communicate in the league. Somebody decide to do it. Uh, I'd like Bash has done one, and uh, uh, so is Nico. So I think I think Connor needs to step up. And uh, he's done one in the past. Connor, I'm calling you out. Uh, someone has to do it uh, this week or there will be no previews. Okay, here we go. Uh, week seven highlights. Uh, Packers, Cowboys. This game was topsy-turvy toward the end. Really close. Uh, I think it was separated by five points all night on Monday Night Football. Uh, but... Uh, you know, the other Robinson was the star for the uh, Packers um, in this one, the running back Robinson versus the wide receiver Robinson. Um, Tua is uh, now on the squad and uh, going to start. Uh, I'm not sure I'm going to put him in. Uh, but the Cowboys go down, Ron's team go to one and six. Packers five and two, uh, second in the overall rankings now. Moving on, the 49ers go to Arizona. Amber's just too much. Amber takes them down. Arizona's Am Amber's cards take them down. Uh, Murray, Hopkins, Kamara, 81 points. I mean, how do you beat that? Um, someone's going to have to take her down as, as the season goes on. Uh, hope for an injury or whatever. But uh, right now, Amber's on top, number one seed. Chris falls out of the top eight board this week to three and four, but I know he's not done. Uh, moving on the lines, Nico, one and six, had a home game. Uh, played hard, lost by eight points to Keegan's Bears. Bears go to five and two, second now in the NFC East. Uh, the Lions lose, uh, you know, guy, uh, I'm sorry, the Lions uh, had Gallup put up a goose egg. Uh, just too much. Bears were strong top to bottom. Uh, moving on, the Oilers uh, and Candace Broncos. Uh, Broncos are falling here. Candace, got to get on your game. Uh, the Broncos go to five and two, Oilers four and three. Oilers, the biggest mover this week into the top eight board to the number six spot. Uh, Brandon's Oilers, former champions uh, last year, reigning champs, if you will. Uh, Oilers go to four and three. Uh, Broncos five and two. The AFC West is really getting tight. Uh, complete uh, game by the Oilers. Uh, second loss in a row for the Broncos. Uh, Kansas City, Connor gets a win over the Raiders on the road. Goes to four and three, 115 to 76 over Prentice Raiders. Uh, the AFC West, five and two, four and three, four and three, three and four. Everyone's in it. Uh, keep playing hard. And uh, another big mover this week, not in the top eight board yet, uh, but sneaky there as harsh as Rams. 160 points, guys, to the Steelers, 70. Uh, David got his butt whipped in this one. Uh, Lockett had 53. Bear had uh, uh, 39 for the Rams, just too much. That's three in the row for the Rams. Watch out for Harsh going forward. And then uh, the Pats, Joshua gets a win um, over the Colts, a pretty convincing win. Uh, taking a look at the AFC uh, East here. Uh, the Colts are four and three. Joshua's Pats are three and four. Uh, Cody's Cleveland Browns are three and four. And the Steelers are two and five. Steelers, David, you're only two games back. Lots to go here. Exciting there. Uh, and then finally, Cleveland and the Giants. The Giants win this game over Cody. Uh, that keep Browns do stay number eight ranked and on the top eight board. Uh, Giants sitting at ninth right outside the top eight board. Uh, Devontae Adams, 44 points, helped the Giants there. So it's really exciting, guys. Uh, keep on playing hard. Uh, just remember that, uh, that uh, anything can happen here. Uh, some of the teams, let's see here real quick. Uh, uh, Cowboys, one and six. And, you know, I think Ron might be out of it. I'm watching you, Ron. I'm watching you for the spoiler award. Uh, uh, but you're, I, I think you're playing hard. And uh, that's good. You got to spoil some uh, some of these teams that are on the top eight board. If you go to the main league page, I have updated the top eight board as such. And uh, the six, seven, eight, the numbers behind that is able, so I can go back and track 
uh, who beat who uh, on the week they were on the top eight board. You can't beat a team that's on the top eight board in week four in week five if that team's not on the top eight board. So that's the way I keep up with that. And uh, 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 you guys that are on the bottom, when you play one of these top eight board teams, uh, you want to win that game, have a chance to be first to draft next year. All right, guys, have a great week.